Whether you're a contractor or a customer, Irigreen installations are simple and quick. This video will cover that process from start to finish. Make sure you have a few things covered first. New installations come with a checklist and QR codes to track progress and get in-depth instructions. You'll need a trencher or shovel, PVC or poly piping, gloves, a drill, and a tape measure. Now let's get started. All Irigreen systems require between 40 to 80 pounds of constant pressure. Eight or more gallons per minute of flow is essential to ensure each head is supplied maximum water for maximum distance. Lastly, one inch PVC or poly piping is required. No PEX or blue lock piping. Step one, call 811 before you dig. That way you can request that underground utilities and cables be marked, ensuring your safety and preventing costly damages. Use your design from our website for the basic zone markings. Pay attention to any trees or obstructions in the yard. You'll have to cater your design for those changes. If you meet our requirements, your sprinklers have the potential to get a maximum distance of 30 feet. The sprinkler cables are 60 feet long, which will get you connected from head to head. 60 or 150 foot extension cables can be purchased on our website. If you are under our requirements, you are likely to get under 25 feet of throw. Step two, you can start trenching. For this install, we're using a vibratory plow with two wire mesh pipe pullers. We'll be pulling blue poly piping for water and black conduit for the cables. You can use a trencher or hand dig depending on the scale and complexity of the installation. Use tarps for the excess dirt to make back filling easier. Set your trencher or plow to 12 inches minimum to retain the same depth and elevation as the irigreen heads without affecting flow. Still contact your local municipality for restrictions. Master valves are not required but are recommended on any irrigation system. If you're implementing a master valve, gather up these tools. For this install, we're using a 1-inch Hunter PGV master valve. Using your Teflon tape, wrap the main connection 8 to 10 times for an efficient seal. Then connect the female poly adapter. Assemble your master valve connections using couplers for PVC or poly couplers and crimps. We recommend feeding the irigreen controller and sprinkler cables through the conduit using a fish tape. The female plug with the black cap always points away from the controller, while the male plug with the red cap always points back to the controller. You'll repeat this step for all the sprinkler cables if you are using conduit. For this installation, the controller will be mounted in the basement, so we'll be feeding the connections through the wall. Strip the ends and secure them with wire nuts or, for extra waterproofing, DBY connectors. This is a great time to note that while regular irrigation wire can be cut, an irrigreen cable can never be spliced. You will void your warranty while experiencing connection and electrical issues. Step 3. Time to get our controller set up. Before you start connecting sprinklers to the cables and water lines, you'll need to get the controller online. Gather these tools and make sure you're connected to the home Wi-Fi. The controller has a built-in mounting bracket with a level. Open the lid, turn the lock on the face plate, and remove the two screws to release the bracket. Our controllers are waterproof, so you can mount them inside or outside your house. You can also use the punch out to run cables out the back of your controller. Use the included anchors and the level on the top of the bracket to help mount. Reinstall the two bottom screws to secure it. Push the cables through the bottom grommets, but don't attach to the controller yet. Now download the app. You'll need to create an account to get started. Are you a contractor? Select the contractor toggle at the bottom of the account creation page. That way, all your customers' accounts can be added to your device. Select Add Controller. 
Allow the Eurogreen app to use the camera so you can scan the unique QR code on the inside of your controller's lid. During this process, you'll be prompted to allow location, local network, and Bluetooth services, all of which are required to get online, assign heads, and pull weather data for your local area. We've also introduced notifications this season, which you can turn on now or later. Hold the center connection button for about 5 seconds. Now select your home Wi-Fi from the list and proceed. Controller 3 can utilize both a 2.4 or a 5 GHz network. After the synced update, you can connect the cables and wires. The red wire will connect to I1 on your controller, and the black wire connects to one of the C common terminals. Irigreen's controller 3 can support 16 Irigreen heads total, but each I terminal can only have a maximum of 8 heads on it. If your installation exceeds 8 heads, you'll have to utilize the I2 port. To the right of that, you can connect one master valve and up to 8 traditional valves. On the far right, you can connect your sensors. S1 and S2 are interchangeable. Our system supports wired rain and soil sensors. Valves and sensors are optional, but an easy addition to the controller. Step 4. Cut into the pipe and install your connections for the swing joint or flex pipe. Both types of inlet connections for sprinkler 2 and 3 are 1 inch. Grab the tools specific to your setup. You won't need all of these. Wrap Teflon tape around the inlet of the pipe, but don't put Teflon on the outlet. Gently tighten with a wrench. After all the pipes are connected, you'll need to flush the lines. Hook up shut-off valves on each flex pipe. That way you can flush each head one at a time. This is required to avoid debris getting into the heads. Step 5. Connecting cables and heads. A reminder before connecting, the male plugs with the red caps always point back to the controller. The female ends with the black caps always point away from it. Hand tighten the sprinkler heads to the pipe outlet. During your wiring, you can utilize our T cable connections to run the cable in multiple directions. Simply connect the cable T at the head or between cables for where you want to split the line. Just note, eight heads on a line is the maximum. Line up the arrows on the plugs and securely push them together. Before clipping the cable lock clamps, you'll need to run a continuity test. Go to More and select Test and Detect. In this instance, our team should have seen eight heads, but the app only found one. If this happens, you'll want to check your connections as something is either loose or a prong is bent. Now pop apart the cable lock clamps and seat them on the connections. We now can see eight heads. Let's continue. Step six, time to assign heads. Irigreen sprinklers must be assigned in the order you want them to run. Stand by your first sprinkler head, navigate to the Zones tab in the app, and tap the plus button in the top right corner. This time you'll notice Bluetooth bars by the names. Hold your phone down by the first sprinkler. The stronger the bars, the closer you are to that head. Tap Identify, and the green cap will begin oscillating. Now tap the circle to the left of the ID and hit Done. Repeat this step for all sprinklers. Step 7. Calibration Keep the top of the sprinklers a quarter inch above ground grade. The heads will all need to update before calibrating. Tap the plus button on the zones page and you'll see the option to calibrate all sprinklers. Select any or all of them in the sequence and begin. If you want to be able to control the spray direction, Calibrate one at a time by selecting the zone and tap the red calibrate button. While the head is calibrating, it will spray anywhere from 5 to 30 feet. The sprinkler's internal pressure sensor is detecting your constant pressure and clocking the varying distances based on that. Congratulations! You've installed an Irigreen system. For more information on setting up maps, schedules, utilizing auto water, or adding traditional valves and sensors, visit our support page at irigreen.com and be sure to like and subscribe to stay in the loop 
on all Irrigreen content. Thanks, and happy watering.